Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and today is Monday the 23rd of April and this is my daily stock signals video where I choose one of the many signals that Wave5Trade throws out every day for stocks trades for the fifth wave Elliott wave move on weekly, daily and 60 minute time frames, both long and short. So lots to choose from. Our members in the members area simply select and I'm going for short trades today so I'll click on shorts uh, they click on the image there for today and they download the spreadsheet so have a quick look at the spreadsheet so it looks like so as you can see after a quite um, in an eventful week last week we have quite a lot of shorts I think on the daily time frame as you see at the bottom there we have weekly daily and 60 minute it's a similar spreadsheet for the longs as well but I've gone for shorts on a daily time frame uh, I haven't uh, done a short for a while so I thought I'd pick one of these to um, show you how it's all set up so let's have a look at the chart okay so I'm using the Elliott Wave indicator suite from wave5trade.com for the ninja trader platform but it is available on thinkorswim trade station and multi charts so for HLX off that spreadsheet on the daily time frame I've gone for a potential short here as you can see for those um, that have the indicator suite for those members um, the isolation was at the high here on the 12th of January from there uh, once we've isolated the wave count we can see that we've had a wave one a two a nice long bearish wave three and we've pulled back against there now so just very briefly to remind everybody the filters that we have on the stock signals membership the 535 oscillator down here this sub chart here with the red and the green that has to pull back between 90 and 140 percent during this wave four and that's where it is right now the stochastic has to pull back um, against the main trend in the overbought zone at this stage and that's where it is and also our waveform pulls back into our automated probability zones and that's where it is now right now so let's zoom in a little bit and have a look so as you can see the waveforms pulled back into our green probability zone and that is an 85 percent probability that's going to go on and make a new wave five low into our target zone here this is all automated on the elliott wave indicator suite and we've got a target of around about 510 in the middle of the target zone there which is pretty good um, very simple to set this up we always go uh, one or two cents above especially on a cheap stock like this um, above the wave four high there's a stop loss and then entry we use a six four moving average low here for an initial uh, start uh, but also we've got to look at this previous uh, rejection at this low here and we need to be going low be below that price as well so for Monday's bar position we've got a 606 entry short which is below the 64 moving average low which is part of the Elliott wave indicator suite plus also below this low here so short 606 660 stop loss gives us a risk to reward of 1 to 1 1.8 something like that into the middle of the target zone so a great risk to reward for this potential short on HLX so just to remind you again this is from wave5trade.com it is the stock signal service but I've been using also just to set this up the Elliott wave indicator suite from wave 5 trade for the ninja trader version so that's it for today have a great trading day and a great week I'll speak to you all tomorrow